about to see a fragment of the core gameplay, which is a mix of crafting, exploration, and storyline tasks. Your main character is a survivor of a huge spaceship crash, stranded among the debris in outer space. Having established yourself a little so far, you can hop onto your space bike and explore nearby areas. The engine is installed, now the tank will probably be able to fly. These are the brackets mounting the tank to the module. You'd better find them all and detach them before you start, or at best, all this debris will spin and be torn apart with the tank right here. A very odd composition, but apparently this mayo doesn't want to freeze. There's also no danger to the space's material, but I'm not sure it's reasonable to stay here with such visibility. In addition, the composition's density prevents you from moving quickly. Seems that detaching the bracket without getting your hands as well as other parts of your body dirty will be impossible. You can try to repair the bracket, but since you will destroy it during the repair process, it will be easier to break it beforehand. An airlock seems to be attached. Seems like the gas coming into the mayo doesn't let it freeze. I have a feeling that something is wrong with this mayonnaise. Apart from the inconsistency of the composition, overly complex technologies are used to transport such biological debris. Although, all the tanks are specified as mayonnaise once in all the invoices related to the liner. This vacuum cleaner is called Rocket for a reason. With it having such a powerful engine, it is really possible to fly it and bypass the technical limitations. Unbelievable. This is heaven knows what, but it's certainly not a simple tank for storing food products. All data indicate that the mayonnaise is not mayonnaise, and the tank was an integral part of the systems of the liner unnamed. We have to start the centrifuge, even just out of scientific interest. Breath Edge takes a humorous approach to storytelling. Things will not go according to plan, and your skillful hands will always find something to accidentally break or blow up. A special patch and a bloated spacesuit indicating increased gas production due to excessive broccoli eating. All this points out that the body belongs to the Green Universe Radical Group. If the possible moral constraints are no problem, this bag of methane, hydrogen, and organic residues could be used to provide initial acceleration to the centrifuge. You only need to figure out how to do it. Despite the fact that the task involved pumping out gas to create a miniature engine with an igniter, your barbaric method for directly lighting your rear end is recognized as effective. It's time to check the control panel. The ship you were on wasn't just a transport, as it turns out. Discover its secrets that are now scattered around, waiting for you to find them.